Today we are diving into something super exciting, something that's been over 11 years in the making for old school runescape, the first new herb seed since OSRS launched, the Huasca seed. Yeah, you heard that right, after over a decade of farming the same old seeds, we finally get something fresh and let me tell you the implications for this are huge. We are going to talk about how this new seed could impact farming profits, the entire herb economy and whether Huasca is set to become the new king of herb farming. First, let's put this into perspective, this is the first new herb seed we have seen since OSRS OSRS launched over a decade ago. That's insane right? It's like Jagex finally heard the farming community and they have given us something fresh to work with. As someone with 200 mil farming XP, I've maxed out farming ages ago and I've been waiting for this for so long. Right now most herb runs net you somewhere between 2 to 300k GP per run depending on which herb you are farming and the market prices but the real question is will the Huasca change that? Could it become the most profitable herb in the game? The XP you get from harvesting Huasca herbs is about half of what you get from farming Tallstool so if you are looking for a new way to get XP this isn't exactly the best option out there and a Tallstool still is supreme but and this is a big but the real story here is profit we don't know what the stabilized price for Waska herbs will be just yet but considering it's brand new and in high demand it could very well skyrocket during these early stages and that leads us to the big question will it surpass Tallstool and the other top herbs like Snapdragon and Rana when it comes to GP per run if Huasca follows the pattern of new high demand items the price could explode especially Especially with the current interest in the mixology herb lore activity which has created a surge in herb demand, this activity needs herbs to get started and that alone could push up the prices for herbs in the game, not just Huasca, so even if Huasca doesn't immediately become the most profitable, we might see an up stick in the price of other popular herbs too thanks to the ripple effect it could cause in the market, it's a win win for herb farmers. Let me tell you the herb patches are always busy, farming herbs is right up there with Slayer in terms of popularity and that's not something I say lightly. I believe with the introduction of Huasca we are seeing a shift in the game where skilling especially farming could start rivaling PVM for profit. Sure PVM has always been the king when it comes to money making but this could be a huge step in the right direction for skilling, players who want to make bank without having to risk it all in dangerous boss encounters. So I did one herb run using all 10 herb patches and received 101 Huasca herbs, I got 731k from the herbs minus the cost of the seeds that gave me a profit of 329k. The only thing I I didn't plant was the Hespori seed which gives you increased yield so that could have made the profit a lot higher. So is the Huasca going to be the most profitable herb in old school runescape? Only time will tell as the market settles but I'd say it's got massive potential whether you are in it for profit or just excited about a new farming option. I'd love to hear your thoughts, are you excited about the Huasca seed? Will you be planting it on your next herb run? Drop a comment down below. You know what to do next, like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave a wonderful comment down below. Thanks for watching, take Take care, bye.